The political shadow boxing of the summer is over. Now it's time for the main event. For Armin Laschet, that means trying to land a few punches on his electoral rivals, both from the Social Democrats and from the Greens. Which is why he's been visiting eco-friendly projects like this, the new Tesla factory outside Berlin. This is the future. The future of energy, the future of sustainability. And we thank you for this investment in Germany. Absolutely. Well, it's a, it's a pleasure to be here. The problem for Laschet is that many people seem unsure about him. Images like these of him laughing on the sidelines of a visit to a flood-hit area last month have damaged his reputation. When he stands alongside Angela Merkel at such events, some believe he struggles by comparison. Some in his home state blame him for their problems. This level of dissatisfaction is mirrored at the national level. When in early spring he emerged as the lead candidate for his party and their Bavarian allies, the CSU, they were polling at around 30 percent. Now they're struggling to stay above 20 percent, with strong challenges from the Greens and Social Democrats. One analyst says Laschet has been trying to stress his environmental credentials in order to stem the flow of votes to the Greens. It seems to that uh, Laschet has to go a bit more uh, towards the issues of the Greens and towards the issues in the public and the social justice things. Although these elections are about choosing who works in Parliament for the next four years, they'll also have a direct impact on who ends up as the Chancellor. For the past 16 years, that role has belonged to the Christian Democrat Angela Merkel, but with her soon to be gone, and now with Armin Laschet in charge of the CDU, their grip on power seems looser, and the threat from the other main parties much stronger. And all the while, the Bavarian Prime Minister Markus Zerda looks on. He wanted to be the lead candidate for the CDU-CSU in September, but lost out to Laschet in the spring. Now the polls suggest most Germans would prefer Zerda as Chancellor and that the CDU-CSU vote would be higher if he was. But such a change, of course, seems highly unlikely with just a few weeks to go. Dominic Kane, Al Jazeera, Berlin.